At a meeting of Prime Minister Benjamin Netanyahu's cabinet on Sunday, a chair sat empty. It would normally be occupied by Israel's Interior and Health Minister Ari Derry, who was removed from office by the Prime Minister. According to an official statement, he gave the news to Derry in a cabinet meeting. It's the first big setback for Benjamin Netanyahu since his return to power a month ago. The dismissal of his health and interior minister came after the Israeli Supreme Court ruled he could not serve in his post due to a conviction for tax evasion. In 2022, Ari Derry announced his withdrawal from political life in order to avoid prison for his conviction before returning last November. For the opposition, his removal shows the fault lines in the far-right coalition government. This is not a government, it's a circus. Netanyahu is weak, but he must appoint a new full-time health and interior minister today. Opposition leader Yair Lapid took to the streets alongside thousands of demonstrators on Saturday. All are protesting against the government's plan to reform the judiciary, which would give more power to politicians. In particular, it wants to give parliament the ability to overturn decisions by the Supreme Court, something that to many Israelis is a threat to democracy.